What's up everybody? It's your boy Mimer. My hair doesn't look that great right now, but what can you do? Uh, for breakfast, I had nothing. For lunch, I had leftover goulash. We call it shuda. Uh, for... which is what we had for dinner last night. I love shuda. Favorite food in the world. Genuinely my favorite food. So good. Um, and for dinner, we are going to be having chicken chili. So yeah, I like chicken chili. It's good. Um, you know, I'm freaking out about Rivian. You know, I've recently gotten into, um, not trading stocks, but buying stocks. Because uh, trading stocks is irritating on, 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 on like taxes. And my dad has to do that since it's like a, a minor account. So I, I don't want to uh, be too much trouble. But um, Rivian is like $60 and they opened at like $130 or something like that. And um, the crazy thing about it is that um, Riv the, the thing that makes Rivian particularly interesting to me is because not only do I think their trucks are cool, uh, I think they look cool. Uh, with the cool light bar and the things. I, I think it's cool. Um, but, um, you know, I also like what they're doing as a company. You know, they split away from Tesla, um, the, the people who work there, and uh, they seem to be doing some good work. They need to work on their software experience for the like, infotainment center. But aside from that, it's good. Uh, and the problem... The problem <laughs> is that... Uh, it's sixty dollars, and I don't have sixty dollars even in my in the, even in my uh, uh, investing account. I have to move like twenty dollars in there so that I can have sixty dollars like liquid that I can I can put the Rivian. Uh, but then that'll be like one third of like the money in my entire portfolio, and that'll be kind of freaky. Uh, yeah, I only have like a hundred dollars. So it's, it's not that crazy. Um, but here's the thing. Here's the thing. Uh, the thing I'm worried about. Well, the thing that I think is cool about Rivian is that Amazon oh, is like a, one of the biggest stakeholders in the company. And I find that particularly interesting because, uh, you know, Amazon, if they're working with Rivian and all this electric truck stuff, um, uh, I think if like their delivery trucks could become like Rivian branded delivery trucks and there'll be all those articles and it'll be like, oh, Rivian, oh, Rivian, like in the news. And, uh, you know, everybody's going to hear about Rivian. And, uh, you know, if they're going for like a no marketing type approach like Tesla, um, I think it'll be really good for word of mouth. Like, you know, oh, I don't get that Cybertruck. Like this Rivian, it has way more features. It has this cool hole through the middle that you can put things in. It's really nice. Um, I don't know. I just like what Rivian's doing. And, uh, you know, ever since I invested in Blue Apron, uh, like a week ago, I've only lost money on it. And even if my Ford and Levi stock goes up, a Blue Raven just balances out. I was thinking, hmm, it went down and then it just stayed down for five years. Maybe I'll invest in it and it'll go back up. But it hasn't gone back up. It's just, got, it's still gone. Surprise, surprise. If a stock has gone down consistently for five years, it keeps going down. So, um, yeah, it's crazy. So I'm, I'm losing money. I have 90, $90 and 14 cents. I now have $86, um, which is a shame. But, All right, see you, dude. I'm so happy about my Jordan break. It's so nice that I can stay up late. I'm very happy about that. So that I can play video games, listen to YouTube, and talk with friends on my computer. They know what they're doing over there. All right, see you, dude.